Hi, welcome to Gallium Lab Tutorials for Data IQ installation. First, let's start by deploying our OVA. Review your chosen configurations. Before starting your virtual machine, please add a hard drive of 500 gigs for storage purposes. Now power on the virtual machine. Sign in using the local host administrator with the password administrator. Now switch to the super user to change the root password using the following commands. Use nmtui to set up your network configurations. Deactivate and then reactivate the connection. Set the system's host name. Use the following commands to set up the system storage. Identify the disk you want to use as storage. Create a physical volume. Now create a volume group then a logical volume. Check to see if all your volumes are created. Run the following command to create a new file system. Manually mount the new drive under slash mnt slash ssd. Edit the fs tab to make sure the new disk will be mounted after reboots. Now perform a yum update. Once completed, use the following commands to start the install. Carefully configure the installer. Accept the EULA, enter the IP address of this node, Enter the FQDN, enter the SSD mounted path, skip license file, press Y to confirm installation, enter root password. Let the installer run. This should take about 10 minutes. At the end of the installation, you can find your web UI password right here. You can now log in using your browser. The username is administrator and the password is the one given at the end of the installation. Once done, you will be prompted to change the password. Now we can configure our isolons or power scales for monitoring. Click on storage system settings, add cluster, input the IP, root and password for the isolon slash power scale. Follow the same steps to add another one, if there is one. Now let's head to the Storage Monitoring tab. Here we can select from many dashboards to view the data from our clusters.
We can also look at the individual systems themselves as well. Thank you for watching. For more information, please contact us.